hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and today we are going to see how to make this uh, object follow through the uh, path chip so this is your first time visit my youtube channel so don't forget to subscribe my channel so support me guys it's very uh, helpful for me the little bit of your action will be make my happiness more more today every day so support me and one more thing uh, if you create the path shape first for your making the animation so uh, let's select the pen tool here in the toolbar select the pen tool and draw the shape uh, for your uh, what what shape you want to do so just draw and you can if you want to change this shape you can adjust this using the pen tool tabs Um, but more okay now this is your first layer for your road ship so i can choose this name for black this is uh, i mean sorry white and took these two duplication uh, duplication of this path shape so for the duplicate of the layers control d and take the two times and name change the name is will be black and this will be dash the center line in your row the roads the dash line will be followed so turn off this three for the so like the last one the white and make this shape value will be i mean stroke value will be 150 and change the color to white and then the uh, second layer turn on the second layer and the black and the stroke will be the good to fit already done uh, 110 will be good i can you can change the uh, stroke value as per your editing size of your road size so the first one will be dash Turn on the dash and the stroke color will be white and stroke shape um, particularly on 10 will be good and but the line will be with the straight line the, you need to do a bit of dash uh, with checker line so here you can select the dash line and down arrow contents shape and strokes and here you can see the dashes so you can use the this dashes you can make the stroke uh, dash lines so click ok in the blush icon you can get the dash lines so if you increase this dash line uh, value you can get a distance on big size of uh, dash line so i got choose 25 for bit so now you can see this will be good uh the but the moving road you can make this animation will be followed to the uh object so you can make this here for the bit of more moving little bit the lines in center so you can choose this offset will be using the offset you can make the moving animation so i will choose here 50 and you can use the keyframes you can use keyframes to make the animation or else you can use the expression so this is the best stuff using there with before better than using keyframes to use the expression so how i say do uh, expression reduce your time and the effortless useful so using expression is a very better way to animation so right click for the uh, expression panel uh, which need uh, which layer you need to here to uh, need to make the expression so all hold the alt and click the timer button you will get the expression panel so here you can type time you can see here time click and star and i choose 100 so now you can see the line will be move you can change this line the uh, this value will do 100 to 1000 
it's make more fast so this is a concept you can give the how much you value give it's reacting for this value amount of value so i get choose a hundred is a bit cool so good uh you can create a road now you can select this hall right click it and pick composition and name road for your session so you need to go to be a background layer so right click here in new and solid color and choose whatever i will choose yellow and make down now you can see this layer will be move the like you can now you can see the road will be moving the road but uh you need to be a car or lorry whatever some object you need to move move so i've already told the project files and support files you added in the description link so just download it i will apply this three calls in the description link and took those one from now and click ok here so drag it into your control uh, timeline panel so you can choose the car into your path shape so you are going to make this paths to the your path shape so go to the road you can see here the whatever this three or anything in else go to content and shape you can see the path shape so select this path and copy control c and go to this here choose this or uh, position so select the position and here you select this here and paste it so if you get the position of your path shape so now play it the car will be moved by this shape but the car will be very big so make this size will be to fit to your car road size i think 20 will be good but the uh, rotation will be is in the wrong direction so you have to be uh, for the rotation you can press r so make it in 90 degree rotation but it's still the it, but you can still see this object is not uh, make the orient of your part shape so the one more thing the final step of your animation it will be a orientation of your path so if you want to object oriented of your path along the path so right click here you can see transform the last option will be auto orientation for the shortcut is ctrl alt o so click here you can check uh, the weather is off i mean orientation along the path is on or off so if you is not on click ok and now make it on so now play this now you can see the car will be moved to the road along the road inside the road like, look like a road so it, it is a thing you can make this uh, path along the orientation of your path shape so hopefully you you can you could like this tutorial so if you like this tutorial give your comments in below section and like the uh, like button and support me and subscribe my channel so have a nice day guys thank you bye